Holy shit. Holy shit. John Gruden has just announced that he is resigning as Raiders head coach. Ah, uh, a bunch of emails leaked out. Uh, he was already in it very badly with the team because of his remarks about uh, one of the leaders for the players organization, um, NFL PA. Um, I guess he mentioned something about the guy's lips. Um, the description, honestly, to me, in my in my opinion, that was actually not racist. It was very insensitive, like a motherfucker, but it wasn't racist. However, <laughs> this dude went way too far on a lot of his um, emails. And, dude, they came with them receipts, man. They came after him hard. Whoever the hell leaked this, they wanted him gone. They really wanted him gone. Um, this is crazy, man. I, I am tripping out on how quickly this escalated. Uh, Raiders coach John Gruden resigns after just totally. Wow. Like, wow. Uh, honestly, guys. I didn't think this was going to happen, but after reading what he said and the way he phrased it and all the other negative shit he said, he pissed everybody off. It's like he he went through the line on every single race, ethnicity, sexual orientation, um, gender. He just insulted every single thing you should not insult. And yeah, uh, he deserves to not fucking be a coach in the NFL. I'm not going to front on that, guys. Uh, uh, but at the same time, that was 10 years ago. A lot of the stuff that they're bringing up was 10 years ago. Maybe he's changed. Maybe he's better. Either way, uh, this shit is going to come back and bite you in the ass. When you think like this and act like this nowadays, there's consequences, man. And uh, honestly, guys, I'm just surprised, man. I am very surprised with with the way this ended up. I didn't. I thought like you know, this is bad. I knew something bad was gonna happen, uh, dude. In my opinion, guys, when I read everything he said, I knew he was gone. I knew he was gone. I didn't know whether it was gonna be at the end of the season or this quick, but uh, yeah, I knew he was gone. Uh, damn, this th hey yo, on the real, it had to happen, guys. I mean, I I don't agree with cancel cu culture. But at the end of the day, it, it is what it is. Uh, you say shit like this, there's going to be repercussions to it now. It doesn't matter whether it was today, yesterday, a year ago, 10 years ago. Um, you got to bring that kind of shit to the forefront and admit to it and actually apologize for the way you thought. There's just things you do not say. All right. <laughs> there's just things you do not say, man. Uh yeah, maybe uh, 10 years ago it was okay. Maybe 10 years ago it was like whatever. But uh, nah, man, uh, this, this ain't this ain't the society we live in now, man. Everybody is held accountable to their actions. And it sucks that our coach uh, was actually, who actually coached the team for the first openly gay person would use terms like what he did. And our coach, who actually is representing an organization that was the first organization to hire a woman CEO, would say that he didn't want women referees. And then our coach, who actually, you know, stood by while other coach, while people were representing uh, what was going on in the world and standing up for, uh, you know, discrimination against blacks. And he would say, go against that. And th there were so many things that he just took the wrong stance with. I, um, nah, man, uh, I can't agree. I, I can't agree with Gruden on this. I am uh, happy he's resigning and taking responsibility and taking the, uh, uh, taking action before he gets fired because he really should take responsibility for something like this. Uh, you should not let it come down to you having to get fired, right? You got to step up, be a man, and just say what you did was wrong and step down. That so I, I'm I'm happy that he did that. However, I am disappointed that our season started taking hit after hit, and now this. As a Raider fan, uh, this is very frustrating. 
Uh, he, he, John Gruden, man, he he let us down, man. He he let us down. I, I'm not gonna front uh, on many parts, and a lot of people were calling for his head, anyways. So y'all got your wish. Uh, it sucks, but it is what it is. Uh, I I have nothing else to say on the matter. I'm a Raider fan. I'm a Raider fan. I ain't a John Gruden. I'm a Raider fan. All right. Uh, what he was saying doesn't represent in any way what this organization is about. So I get why he resigned, man. I, I, I'm i pretty sure Mark Davis told him you could either resign or I'm going to fire you. Because uh, at the end of the day, he's just like his dad when it comes to that kind of shit. He doesn't put up with that kind of shit. I honestly just, I'm in awe, man. I, I just can't believe this happened. Uh, it is what it is, guys. Uh, Got to move on. Hopefully this team can pull this self together. Uh, we do not have a head coach now. Um uh, someone's going to stand in as the interim. We'll see what happens. Uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, this is uh, my room. It's my Raider stuff. Got a picture of uh, Cliff Brands here. Sign signature. Uh, for those of you wondering why I have a Rams hat here, that's my uh, cousin Alonzo. He passed away. Um, me and him were really close. So I keep that hanging. Uh, anyhow, uh, man, I, I'm, I just can't believe that I'm, I'm in shock guys. And this, this kind of shit, I know it happens to every, um, other famous person where shit gets leaked out and shit gets brought up from your past. But, uh, I did not see this coming. Like, I seriously didn't see this coming. And when I heard about the lips, I thought they were, you know, I thought they were reaching. Now come to find out, they were just picking low-hanging fruit, and there was a bunch of shit on that tree. That's some crazy shit, dude. I mean, if you know that emails and shit like that's out there, you should just bring it to the forefront and admit to what you're wrong and take the fucking punishment right away. Otherwise, you're going to end up getting canceled like this. That's simple as that. Uh, You got to own up to your shit. Uh, Lord knows that I, I probably have skeletons in my closet that I forgot about, but, uh, honestly, at the end of the day, man, uh, it is what it is. This is the, this is the fucking culture we live in now. So, uh, you got to accept it. It sucks, uh, that we don't have a coach now. Uh, we'll see who takes over for him, but, uh, yeah. All right, guys, that's going to do it. Like, comment, subscribe, go Raiders.